arguably the greatest self-promoter in the history of sports, was heavyweight champion Muhammad Ali. I would love listening to his poems when he was going to fight Sonny Liston. A left by Ali, a right by Ali. Sonny Liston has been lifted out of the ring, and for the first time in the history of boxing, it's a solar eclipse of the sunny. Oh, man, did I love listening to him. But then I was thinking, if he was a golfer instead of a boxer, maybe he would have sounded something like this. When I play golf, there's no fun, because every hole's a hole in one. Some like sweet, some like bitter, but I'm the longest hitter. Some people think I'm crazy, others think I'm hoping, but I'll show you one at all. I'll win the U.S. Open. And, of course, the first person to get the story Hello again, everybody. Howard Cosell talking about golf. Mohammed, I don't think you know the first thing about the game. Tee it high, let it fly. Tee it low, let it go. Hit it clean, it's on the green. Let it roll, it's in the hole. I'm so pretty, my name is Ali. I put like a butterfly, drive like a bee. Right now I'm little, but someday you'll find I'll be greater than Nicholas and Tiger combined. I'll be the greatest of all time. You mentioned Jack, Nicholas, and Tiger Woods. I don't think you could beat me, Howard Cosell. How'd Cosell go get Cosell? If I want some fun, I'll burden one. If you start the job, I'll ace number five. If you don't say I'm great, I'll shoot 58. Go get Cosell. If I lose to Cosell, I'll crawl across the green, clean his spikes, tell him he's the greatest, and caddy for him the rest of my life. Go get Howard Cosell. One can only ponder. Will Ali follow in the dull drum mediocrity of the unknown, or will he become the greatest golfer of all time, Howard Cosell? reporting.